Hi guys and welcome to 123MyIT's video on how to reset your Mac OS X password. Okay guys, so I have plenty of people ask me on the 123MyIT.com website or on the YouTube channel uh, when we're talking about administrator passwords or passwords of the, of the OS X or the passwords of your Mac computer, what is the password and how do you reset it? if you don't know what it is. So let's just go ahead now. We're talking about this password and this password is generally set up when you set up your Mac. So for me, it's just one, two, three. We're gonna log into the uh, Mac here. And I'll just show you real quick how you can actually see what users you have on your Mac and what passwords they have. If you go down to system preferences, go into users and groups, and you have all your current users down the side here. So at the moment you can see we've got the 123MyIT and it's underneath there, it's admin, so it's the administrator account. If we click on the little padlock, it'll then prompt us for our username and password here. So at this stage, if you don't know what this username and password is, I will show you how to reset this. But if you do know, you can type in your password there. And then if you wanted to reset the uh, the user's password. You can just click on the change password link, put in your old password, put in your new password, verify it and put in a password hint and then click on change password. Now let's say you click on the padlock here and you don't know what the password is. Well, there's a few ways that you can reset this. It's going to be quite difficult um, because it is, a, is a, a password that's set up when you actually install or set up the Mac. So we're just going to close that down and the first way to do it is you need to actually put your Mac in uh, recovery mode. So to do that, to put your Mac in recovery mode, we're actually going to need to restart the Mac, but we're going to need to hold down Command and R, okay, uh, when it's restarting. So let's go ahead and we'll restart it. So go to Apple, restart like you normally would, and then hit the restart button, and then straight away we want to hold down Command and R. Once you see the Apple logo, you should be able to just let go of the Command and R button. Okay guys, so after a few minutes, you should get this OSX Utilities page coming up. Um, this is the recovery part. If it doesn't work, you can always create yourself a USB that does the recovery mode for you. Okay, so there is a tutorial on the 123myt.com website, which will show you how to set these up. Now I make uh, USB, so I've got one for Yosemite, which is an older OSX version, and I've also got one for El Capitan, um, which is the latest version. However, once you create that USB, you can pop it in the side, hold down your option key, boot into the USB, and it will take you into this exact same screen, this utility screen here. Okay, um, so the next step that we need to do if we need to reset our password for our Mac, we want to go into utilities, we want to go into the terminal screen. We just want to type in reset password. All right. When we do reset password, we get this other screen that will come up and it says here, reset password, select the volume containing the user account, okay? So we wanna select our Macintosh HD because that had our user account on there. And then you can see here, select the uh, user account. So we've got a system administrator account which we didn't actually see in the users and groups section on our Mac. So we just wanna reset our 123 password. So enter a new password for this user. So I'm going to call it 123456. And then I'm going to type it again, 123456. Okay, now we can put in a hint. I'm just going to put 12, and that should remind me of the rest of the password. I'm going to hit save. Okay, login reset. Then it comes up with a little prompt here. I'll read it out to you guys. The login password for 123MyIT was reset. The user default keychain password wasn't changed. If the default keychain password is different from the login password, user will, will be asked for a password whenever the application needs to access the default keychain, if that keychain is locked. To change the password for the default keychain, restart the computer and use the keychain access in the utilities folder under the applications folder. All right, so we want to just close that. Close that again, and do a, another restart. Okay guys, so we're back at our, our login screen now, and I'm gonna try the new password. So remember the old password was one, two, three. I'm gonna try the new password, one, two, three, four, five, six, and hopefully it should work and log us in. All right, and it did log us in. So now that we've come up with a little uh, lock chain, it says, if you remember your old password, you can update the keychain password. If you do not remember your old password, 
you can create a new login keychain or choose to leave the login keychain using a different password. So we do remember our old password, but the majority of the time is you won't remember. So we would say if you do not remember your old password, you can choose create a new login keychain. So what we want to do is go new keychain, which is the middle one. So there you go, we are now logged into our Mac and we have access uh, with the reset password. Okay guys, so if this was helpful, please leave a thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe. Feel free to leave a comment in the comments field. And thanks for watching guys, bye bye.